What time is it? Did I have to do the thing? Mail time! <laughs> I'm worried about this box. Because it's like... Rolly? It's rolly and heavy. I think I remember hearing the human head is 11 pounds. We got an 11 pound box that rolls. How do you know that's how much a head weighs? I thought it was like everybody knew that. Like a human head weighs 11 pounds. It makes the world go around like it's a saying. <laughs> let's open it up. Let's see if we found it. Uh, Hitler's long lost mummified head. Don't be gross, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> that's a nice looking cutty thingy. What do you call this, Dan? That is called a Tanto 2 from waterjetknives.com. Go there if you want to make your own. Are they the sponsor of today's video? They are now. Yeah, it could still be a head. It, it very well could be a oh, small head. Shrunken head? It appears to be a solid ball of electrical tape. Um, but there's a note that we so rudely didn't read first. So it is rude to just go straight for the gift. We watch your channel and wanted to see you either cut in half or shoot or both this big roll of electrical tape our uncle made. <laughs> this, Damon, Brindley, and Cambria. Is this their weird uncle? I, I don't know. <laughs> Probably. If there's an uncle making balls of tape, I think it's safe <laughs> to say yes. This he, is the weird he, uncle. He's the weird one. <laughs> like, that is hard. <laughs> That's how you know it's hard when you throw it on the ground. Next step is just to cut it in half. Wait, what is that? I have some drinks doing over there, um, This is us working on a different video that's not panning out, so ignore this and maybe you'll see it in the future. <laughs> no longer need that, that, that. my gosh. I mean, that looks like solid plastic. It feels like solid plastic. <laughs> it's like when we cut the bowling ball. <laughs> you cannot see individual strands of tape in there. See like little layers? Rings like a tree, but so how many there is zero air gap in there though. That is incredible. That's one weird uncle. Are you that weird uncle in your family, Dan? I am. The water jet uncle. Are you that weird uncle? Oh, yeah. Uncle water jet, lick this. <laughs> You're going to have to edit that out. <laughs> that sounded too weird. <laughs> I thought maybe you'd see like a small ball or something in the middle. Or... Well, yeah, you can't even see like how it started. Like, how did he start it? How many rolls of tape do you think this was? Lick it. 114. There you go. Let's make this the new trend on YouTube. You had aluminum foil balls. Good you time. had, I don't know what other trends there were having to do with balls. Um, this is the new trend, electrical tape balls. Oh, we did a rubber band ball, that was cool. Rubber band ball. <laughs> Next package, uh, this one. Uh, this one we're a little bit more embarrassed by. Without um, showing, uh... I won't show the information. We didn't cross this one off. This was mailed on September 2nd, 2017. So we've had it for almost two and a half years. We were cleaning out some space. We're remodeling the office, which is what Craig's doing up there. It's laid, it's, <laughs> it's made out to water jet Chanel babes. <laughs> that must be us. We've got balls. Hey. I think we've got a theme going on here. Cut these cricket balls and lick them, please. Uncle Sean. Cricket balls. This is looks like a tennis ball. It feels like something heavy. It's it's a solid core tennis ball, which I assume is for cricket. How do you know it's solid core? It will just feel solid core. You said it like you knew. Well, I know in my heart that it is. We gotta cut it in half to know, Dan. <laughs> I'm 
calling solid core tennis ball. No, that's the wrong one. Doesn't look like a tennis ball at all, Dan. It's more like Rubbery. a stress ball. Solid core tennis. Oh, it wasn't solid. But closer to, than normal. Is it rubbery? Yeah, but it's just a lot thicker. You know how people put like cut tennis balls on the uh, legs of their walkers? Mm -hmm. That one would last like 10 years. You could walk so far. <laughs> <laughs> that one is solid. That one was hard like a rock. This one's got like oh. chopped up pieces of children's bouncy balls in here. That is rock solid. And that is also what is inside of three different types of cricket balls. The more you know. If that's, that still looks like a tennis ball to me. If there's no target on the wall, then... Um, you can't miss. I can't miss. Unmissable. I don't even know if you'll see it with the white clay on that white wall. I think we will. Is that where you were going? It is now. <laughs> I'm actually going about three feet higher and three feet to the right. <laughs> okay, now you have to try and hit your first one. <laughs> what the... Was I close? Was that intentional? No. It had to have been intentional. <laughs> then yes, it was intentional. Okay, try again. Your first one. <laughs> okay, you're getting warmer. Each one's getting better. <laughs> the last one's gonna like hit the ceiling. <laughs> oh, you digressed. One time I made a rubber band ball uh, about this size and we cut it in half and it was it was actually pretty cool. One of my favorite videos. Um, not a ton of people saw it, so I was thinking about doing it again, um, but maybe you could just go watch it. Uh, we also cut knives. If you'd like a custom made knife plank and make your own knife like this, uh, you can buy a knife plank at our store. Don't point knives to your eyes.